Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the push notifications. Today we are going to learn about the how to set up the one signal on the React web app. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So first of all, we have to create the one signal account. So those who haven't have account for this, you have to create that account first. Okay, so I have already created my account. So make sure you have to sign up and create the account. Then you have to go to the this section that is a dashboard. Okay, so if I just go back to the one signal. Okay, so here you can see that we have a apps. If you don't have the apps, then you have to create the new app and the website. Mention it like whatever app you have. So I'm going to make it like technical Rajni app. Okay. And organization, you have to select the web applications because I'm testing on the web because React is a web. Okay, configure the platform. Then go to the next tab. Here we have the custom codes. Just select it and uh, mention your website. Test website. And you are, if you're testing on the local host, then make sure that uh, you have to enable, you have to add the site URL like this localhost 3000 okay and treat like a localhost and if you want a default icon you can add your default icon like this just drag it from the and here i'm going to add this icon okay i'm going to add this icon save this <coughs> done now i'm going to get the save this and now i'm going to get continue with this url you will also with the Let's continue with this URL, okay? Because I have already created another app, right? So this configuration will come. Now you have to download one signal SDK files, download all, and put all these files to the this public folder. So this is only one file that come up. So you have to paste it over there, okay? Nothing else. Then we have a code. So just copy this script to the index.html. So here we have index.html file. I have to paste it like this. After this, we have an, uh, you have to go with this one. So this needs to be in the setup of the React. So make sure you have to create a new app.js file. So import the React and the use effect from the React. And make sure you have to install the React one signal, NCAM I React one signal. You have to install this one. After this, in the use effect, you have to add the one signal in it with the app ID and notify button. So this is that one app ID and the notify button. And if you want to go with the allow local host secure origin then you can make it like this okay you have to set up and export this one right and after running this you will get this kind of ui okay and now i'm going to send the notification push and uh, here we go new push i'm going to make a new one that is test campaign test campaign and send to the all subscribers what we have and uh, hi te hey technical rajni Okay, how are you all? Okay, so you can add like this. Okay, and if you have an image, you can upload it. If you have a bit icon, you can also add it. And where you want to redirect, you can do icon from the Chrome image batch, you can add. And now I'm going to just do settings, delivery schedule immediately or specific time. Everyone you want to send intelligent delivery, custom time zone, you can do the settings like this. Okay, then review and the send. And now platforms all, hey technical, how are you? Message starts immediately. And sending, now you can see on the top of it, you will get the message. So currently I'm not getting the message. Let me restart the, okay, okay, okay. Because the ID, I'm not using that ID because my ID is from this one, this application, I have the ID. So I need to generate the message from this one. Okay, so, so profile pictures, I will say, and uh, I will just mention, paste this. Hey, technical version. Okay. How are you? Okay. And let's add like this and just send. Okay. 
and now you will get the message hey technical rajni how are you you will see the message my logo and all okay so this is how you can send the notification via one signal app in the react web application any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day